Corporate Designation. Well, what is a CMA? A CMA is a corporate financial professional uh, who acts as a strategic business partner within an organization. There is a two-part exam that you must pass, and it requires quite a commitment. But once you are successful in passing both exams, then that tells your employer that you are an expert in the field of management, and you belong to an international group of professionals, and your value to the employer will increase significantly. Who puts this together? Well, it's the Institute of Management Accountants, the Association of Accountants and Financial Professionals in Business. Now, they're based in New York City. And the exam is a, each of the exam consists of 100 multiple choice and two essay type questions. And therefore, you have to pass both of them. The exam itself is scheduled three times a year, January, May, and September. You choose what time you want. You go to the testing center and you will be tested on 100 multiple choice questions. Once you pass them, then you can do the two essay questions at the end of the exam. It's a four hour exam. How can I help you get your CMA? Well, I've been around 35 years teaching people helping them earn their CMA designation. I did a number of years work on the CMA examination board, so I know what they're looking for, and I know how they mark and design these uh, exams. What can you expect by taking this course? Well, there's a number of things you can. The IMA, the way we approach this, is the IMA has published over 500 learning objectives. Now, I take these objectives, and then I turn them into questions to be answered. So in this course, you'll become familiar with the answers to those questions. You will be frequently tested as to your understanding of the concepts. I do that with Socrative, a program, an online program. And you will develop an ex exam strategy to answer the questions in this exam. Now, obtaining your CMA will require a huge investment, but look at the payoff you get. Look at the difference between CMA salaries and non-CMA. Now, this is a little bit dated, but nevertheless, it gives you an idea of how much more valuable the CMA is. So your return on the investment in obtaining your CMA will be done within a couple of years and will last you the rest of your professional life. So get that certification. And that's my goal with this course, is to help you get that. Who am I? Well, I am uh, Dr. John McClellan, and I'm a CMA with my MBA and my PhD. So welcome to this course, and together we will work towards you obtaining your Certified Management Accounting designation.